It's been a while. Since last we met, I got a haircut, went on vacation, got a nice tan, came back sick, went on a wildlife safari, got jump scared by a giraffe, and I'm gonna eat some bugs. <coughs> I still have my cough. So, not excited about this. When I went on the wildlife safari that I mentioned before, like they do at all little novelty shops, they had bugs to eat. And like flavors. So let's see, I've got larva in Mexican spice flavor, um, crickets in sour cream and onion, and also in salt and vinegar. Um, why did I do this to myself? I need a vomit bucket. I'll be back. Achievement unlocked. Bark bucket. Okay, so I saw these and I've always seen these places and I've always wondered what they taste like. Oh, so I bought some and then I decided to film it because it'll be funny. Oh my gosh, on the back. Can you guys see this? I don't know if this will focus on this or if you, it's washed out maybe, I don't know. It's got, oh, it lists the parts of a cricket. So we've got the drumstick, the rump, the flank, the wings, and the breast. As if it's a chicken. This is not a chicken. This is crickets. And let me just get you guys a good shot of that. Now that I've spent 30 minutes trying to get my freaking camera to focus, I should probably get something to drink. I think I'm just prolonging the inevitable, really. What are you afraid of? My room is a disaster area. Does this look weird? Does this? Is this normal? Does this? Oh well, I'm just prolonging everything. Mmm. Delicious. <gasps> My geodes! We're totally gonna break these open after this. Anywho, the original worm snack. The larva. Let's go here. Oh. I'm, I'm regretting this already. Comes in a nice little sealed packet here. I'm not, ooh. Mm. It. <coughs> I don't, I don't remember Mexican spice being sweet. But this most definitely smells sweet. Okay. Here's one for proof. It's in my hand. Okay. Oh. Huh. Oh, I can see. Oh, oh. It has legs. It's got. Oh. I don't want to eat this. Okay. Oh gosh. <laughs> okay. Um, it's small. It's small. It's tiny. It's got flavoring. It's small. It's tiny. It's got flavoring. I thought I thought. Oh. It doesn't really have any taste. But it gets stuck. I get stuck back here. You want some of these? You can't have any. Oh, okay. It wasn't terrible. It was like, you know, those little, those little flakes that come off of the, um, of like the corn that doesn't pop, like the kernels and popcorn. It was like having a whole bunch of those in your mouth and they just get stuck right there. I just ate a book. Why does my hair still look frizzy? I put so much stuff in you. Oh well. Larva. Down. These were expensive too. These things were not cheap. I'm saving these. I'm gonna make somebody else eat some. <sighs> Crickets. Should I do <coughs> salt and vinegar first? 
We're sour cream and onion first. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, catch a tiger by the toe. If you always let him go, my mama told me to pick the very best one, and you are not it. Mickey Mouse had a house. Okay, whatever. We're doing, we're doing. I feel like salt and vinegar is going to have a stronger flavor to it, so we'll do the sour cream and onion first. That way, if it's terrible. What if it's terrible? Okay. I'm not looking forward to this. Oh. 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 Mmm. Now, I am not afraid of bugs. Let it be known, okay? But something about holding a dead one with legs that I'm supposed to eat isn't appealing in any capacity. Yeah, it's gross. Prepare yourself mentally, physically, emotionally. I don't want to do this. Why did I think that this was a good idea? Why did I want to do this ever? Why did, why am I curious? Why am I such a weird individual? I don't know. Mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. There's zero flavoring. There's zero. Mm, I'm stuck. in my brain that was like, yo, you're eating a bug. And I attempted to rid myself of said bug. It did not taste good. It tasted like dirt, like bad dirt. Like, it's still in my mouth. <sighs> Ugh. Sour cream and onion done. Maybe the salt and vinegar will have flavor and hide the gross cricket taste that I just tasted. Why am I doing this? Other people did it, Amber. You can do it too. It'll be funny. You'll film it. It'll be great. Ugh, I don't want them. Okay, salt and vinegar. Here we go. These don't seem to have legs. Should I go for the big one or the small one? Go big or go home. Oh, now these smell of salt and vinegar. That is for sure. My cat is even like, oh, that smells delicious. You don't get any of this. Last one, last one, last one, last one. Then pretty geos, pretty geos, pretty. Ooh, excuse me. Very <coughs> salty. <laughs> Ooh, ooh, ooh. It tastes like a bad sunflower seed. Oh. That's exactly, it tastes like a bad sunflower seed. The salt and vinegar ones, those of you who eat sunflower seeds, you'll know you'll get that like bad one that just tastes awful it just tastes so bad it's like bitter and gross it's that taste that like a bad sunflower either they got over roasted or it wasn't good to begin with i don't know but it was that taste in my mouth and i hate it <laughs> okay overall i think i went from easiest to hardest on accident um, the larva was pretty easy. It pretty much just crunched up in your mouth. It was like those little flakes off of, you know, the kernels of corn that don't pop in the popcorn bag. I mean, the only issue with it was it got stuck here. None of them really have any flavoring other than the salt and vinegar. Like, I couldn't use any sour cream and onion on these. And these smelled sweet, which last time I checked, Mexican spice wasn't sweet. However, the, like, second ingredient in this is sugar, so... 
That would explain a lot. So this was fascinating. Um, and I hope to never do it again. On a scale of... They weren't great. We'll stick with that. Let's go bust open some geodes. Hello, and welcome to my backyard. There's lots of noise happening. I have a hammer. This is the first hammer that I saw, so I grabbed it. It's really heavy. The stuff. So it says to put them in like a sock and beat them with a hammer, but it says use an old sock because your sock will get holes. I don't have any of those, so we're just going to put them in bags here and then put them into this bag and then crush them because that's the same as a sock, right? We are just going to place these in here in an organized fashion. Stuff isn't a thing. And then beat it with a hammer. Ooh, taking you off of the tripod. Yeah, that's not anything that I've ever done before. Ooh. Oh, this hammer is really heavy to be doing this like this. Okay, we're going to back this up a little bit and hope that I don't smash through my cord. Okay, where are they? So there's one there, one there there. Well, I have knocked all the water loose from our fire pit. I don't know if I actually did anything to the geodes or not, but now we have a pleasant water fountain. Okay, back to this. Oh, zoomed in too far. Maybe? I don't know. Let's find out. I think they're trying to teach me how to use a hammer. <laughs> so this bag definitely has a hole in it now. Bag number one. I don't know. It sounds broken. <gasps> hey! <gasps> I feel like I need to wash them off or something. Okay, let's see if all of them are broken. This one is the one that's not broken. No. I think this one's just a rock. <laughs> oh no. Okay, well we'll work with this one a little more to see if I can beat it into submission. And what about this one? Ooh, this one's got... Oh, oh this one worked out well. Look at that. Can you guys see that? <gasps> this one's the best one. Look at it. Oh my goodness. Okay. So I have two successes. I'm one failure. I'm gonna beat this one a little more. And then I'll meet you back inside with rinsed off rocks. Okay, so I'm back inside now and I've rinsed off all of my rocks. And so what what I've got is an interesting little assortment here. So I've got like this little batch of like tiny little shards here that I can't really do anything with that are just sort of cute. I think this was from that rock that I smashed a little too much. Um, but you can see there's some like crystally, you know, stuff in there. Can you guys see that? I don't know. We've got sort of the ones that are more like viable, I guess. The ones that turned out how they were supposed to turn out. So I've got this little tiny doodad. He's small, but he's cute. Um, and then I've got this one which is cool. You've got like this sort of marbling here. Then you've got this little doodad. He's kind of shallow, but he's there. Um, and then this one's probably the best one. Um, it's this nice sort of shaped one here. And it's got, you know, the protruding geode there. And then you have the saddest thing of all, the one that would not break. No matter how much I hit this thing, I was actually creating sparks. Um, so if you look at this side, it's like regular like rock self. Um, but if you look at this side, there's actually some like crystal-y stuff there. It's just like it won't break. So like this is as much of this as I'm ever going to get. Um, so yeah. This was fun. So we learned a lot today. We learned that bugs don't taste good and that geodes are hard. 
And um, my hands smell like rocks. I didn't know rocks had a smell until today. Education! Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I love you, and until next time. Bye-bye!